In the ever-evolving world of literature, certain books emerge not only as stories but as timeless treasures. These rare volumes, often hidden in dusty corners or forgotten collections, hold within their pages tales of discovery, intrigue, and the rich tapestry of human thought and imagination. Here, we unveil 10 rare literary gems that have been rediscovered, offering a glimpse into the past and a testament to the enduring power of the written word. Dating back to the 7th century, the St. Cuthbert Gospel is one of the oldest surviving European books. Discovered in the coffin of St. Cuthbert in Durham Cathedral, this Latin manuscript is remarkable for its exceptional state of preservation and its beautiful craftsmanship. It provides invaluable insights into early medieval religious practices and the artistry of bookbinding. An enigmatic manuscript filled with unknown scripts and bizarre illustrations, the Voynich manuscript has baffled scholars since its rediscovery in 1912. Believed to have been written in the 15th century, its contents remain undeciphered, sparking endless theories about its origins and purpose. It stands as one of the most mysterious books in the world. In 1623, seven years after Shakespeare's death, his colleagues published a collection of his plays, now known as the First Folio. This compilation is crucial for preserving many of Shakespeare's works that might have otherwise been lost. The discovery of additional copies, such as one found in a Scottish church in 2016, continues to be a monumental event in literary history. Also known as the Devil's Bible, the Codex Gigas is the largest medieval manuscript in existence. Created in the early 13th century, it contains a complete Latin Bible, historical documents, and medical texts. Its most famous feature is a full-page illustration of the devil, giving rise to various legends about its creation and the monk who purportedly wrote it. An illuminated manuscript of the Gospels, the Book of Kells is a masterpiece of medieval art. Created by Celtic monks around the 9th century, its intricate designs and vibrant colors make it a jewel of Western calligraphy. Its rediscovery has reinforced its status as a symbol of Irish cultural heritage. In 1945, a collection of 13 ancient books was discovered near Nag Hammadi in Egypt. These texts, written in Coptic, include a variety of early Christian Gnostic writings that were previously unknown. Among them is the Gospel of Thomas, which has significantly altered our understanding of early Christian theology. The Diamond Sutra, printed in 868 AD, holds the title of the oldest known printed book in existence. Found in the Mogao Caves of China, this Buddhist scripture exemplifies the early use of woodblock printing. Its rediscovery has provided profound insights into the history of printing and the dissemination of religious texts. Printed by Johannes Gutenberg in the 1450s, the Gutenberg Bible is the first major book produced using movable type. Its creation marked the beginning of the print revolution in Europe. Copies are exceedingly rare and valuable, with recent discoveries and auctions attracting significant attention from collectors and historians. Discovered in the mid-20th century in the Qumran Caves near the Dead Sea, these ancient Jewish texts date back to the 3rd century BCE. The Dead Sea Scrolls include some of the earliest known manuscripts of the Hebrew Bible and have vastly expanded our knowledge of Jewish history and the origins of Christianity. The Sarajevo Haggadah, a beautifully illuminated Jewish manuscript from the 14th century, has a storied history of survival, including being hidden during the Bosnian War. Its pages recount the story of Passover, and its rich illustrations provide a unique glimpse into medieval Jewish art and culture. These ten rare books, each with their unique story of discovery and significance, remind us of the profound impact of literature on human civilization. As they resurface from the shadows of history, they not only enhance our understanding of the past, but also inspire future generations to cherish and preserve the written word.